check one, check two, we have microphones. Finally starting to thaw out here. I'm collecting a few boxes out here in the old workshop. Time to start opening them and putting them on. First box is from Haley Bars, Bar Risers. Two inches up, two inches back for the Pan America. I don't really have any problems when I sit. When I stand, it would be nice to be a little bit higher. Uh, maybe when I'm riding on the road, it would be nice to be a little bit higher, a little more comfortable, upright. So let's see what is in this child protected box. Haley Bars, if you're interested, directions. A lot of directions. Wow. I will go through these at my leisure. I do not plan on reading them while I record this because that's just plain silly. Let's see what else is in here. Some paper. The risers themselves. I looked on the website, they look really finished and nice. These, this little section here will fit in the, where the existing bars are. So I guess that's two inches up, two inches back. Ooh, very nice piece of uh, equipment. Feels nice anyway. Not cheap, which I guess no one wants cheap on their bars. <laughs> Extra ball mount. I must just collect these things, but they do come in handy. Couple little buttons, fill in some holes, zip ties, and some nice shiny screws, probably aluminum or stainless, uh, M830s. Let me switch this around, start taking some stuff off the bike. All right, all right, so one of the factors that I've been thinking about before moving to uprights is this little tank bag, uh, SW Motec micro bag. It is an amazing little bag, the way it just sits right here on the tank, comes in handy for any little thing I would like when I'm riding. Uh, don't really have any place to keep like sunglasses, put them on and off, extra batteries. Uh, this little thing is amazing uh, for quick access while you're riding. You can slide a bottle of water in there. Um, I don't know what this is going to turn into when I start um, messing with these handlebars. I think two inches up will be good, but the back may interfere. Um, they have to look at other options. This is the smallest one that SW Motec has. Alright, so let me take off my mirrors, my quad lock, and my GoPro mounts or action camera mounts and see how that looks then. Okay, look at that. Much cleaner design with everything off. Hand guards are off. Left the mount there, but the phone mount's gone. The extra GoPro mount. So now, what I need to do, preemptively, is if you can zoom in, this little clip right here goes for our switch controller. If you look, it's in a part of a wire loom that runs around the brake line. It splits off here. So we got to undo that and get it all on the inside of that brake line, it looks like. Okay, so this is just to show you how the wire loom will look after you move the parts around. Slide this through that. Um, the brake line is out on its own and the wire loom is behind it. And this is where it plugs into the brake and then there's the control housing and the same thing on the other side, but you don't have to shift anything, uh, we're going to run both left and right wire looms behind the stock uh, risers. So they're going to pop out through here. And now I think I get to start putting some stuff together. So here they are. They come up a little bit further, as you can tell, two inches back, uh, two inches higher. Um, they're about comfortable right here. I believe this is close to like their proper orientation. This might need to be adjusted, but this is where close, just because I knew I had to look at these different buttons um, sometimes 
like what is this button anyway um that's it only problem i have um with the install why didn't they use the same size uh heads my ram ball seems to be a little bit too big to fit in here but that may be due to paint um i might try to screw it through the bottom i don't, I don't want to jack that up if i don't have to uh, much cleaner look anyway right who doesn't like that so left right uh, as you can see the electrical loom wires now run behind the standoffs instead of in front and that's why you had to do this little magic here to get the entire to get get it behind there I think that's about it it was a pretty easy install uh, I like them the only problem I have my beloved tank bag oh let me rock and roll on the center stand won't fit uh, it's already at the the furthest position up and it actually hits the mounts for the Healy bars so I don't even want to try to put it in maybe if I put it on backwards it might work Healy bars are in did not put everything back together yet still a work in progress got some other boxes over there thanks for watching this super quick install and ride safe have fun and be kind to each other Minnow is out.